In today's video, I'll be talking to you about the three laws of being a med student in clerkship that I feel doesn't really get talked about too much. But before that... So, story time. When I first started third year of medical school, there was this one quote that I would constantly repeat to myself and it got to the point where I actually wrote this down on a piece of sticky note and I put it on the side of my washroom and I would look at it every morning and the quote was that this is not about me it's about all the people who need my help I'm simply the vehicle for change that being said there is another philosophy that I've literally been repeating and repeating and repeating and telling myself since about almost middle school and it's this idea that I need to become the best possible version of myself for myself. So it wasn't until I finished third year and got to fourth year until this point that I realized that philosophy number one, philosophy number two really contradict each other. They're almost like two extremes of the same spectrum. So that being said, there's almost this dissonance in my head about these two extremes and how I find that balance. And only recently did I realize that life is like a pendulum. And what I mean by that is that most things usually start from one extreme and tend to sway all the way to the other extreme before it tends to naturally find its stability in the middle. A good example of this is the famous French Revolution. Though it was the rise of the peasants against the bourgeois, it wasn't really stable till it found its norm with Napoleon. Now, Napoleon wasn't exactly the average citizen, but having been a part of the revolution, he knew how to balance both worlds. So when you have a system having built its fort in one end and the opposite to it is emerging, rather than thinking about which is right and which is wrong, what's better is to think what the middle would look like. So that being said, I've been reflecting a lot over this last year and a half, and I've come to realize that there are three laws of being a med student in clerkship that I wish I was told and that I've kind of picked up along the way that I'm going to be sharing with you today. Law number one, read around your cases. This is so important and I remember when I was learning uh, in first year and second year, I would constantly be learning something and it'd be out the other ear because it just wasn't sticking regardless of how many times I tried uh, understanding it, reading through it, talking about it, XYZ. It wasn't until my third year that I started seeing these cases and, and once I saw and once I saw it, it would just stick and I'd have those oh yeah moments. Pretty much realizing that hey, this is exactly what that lecturer or what that attending or what that presentation was trying to teach me. But I just didn't realize at that time. But when I saw it in the clinic and then I went and read around the case, it just stuck. Simple. Law number two is find a mentor. This one is kind of self-explanatory. Don't think I really need to explain it in any more detail. I've made tons of videos about this in the past, but I will summarize this with one simple quote. Someone famous once said that I can see further not because I stand taller than others, not because I have stronger vision than others, but it's because I stand on the shoulders of giants of those who have come before me. And law number three, keep it simple, stupid. There's a comma between simple and stupid. And what do I basically mean? Well, pretty much do all the things that your elementary school teacher told you about. Be nice. Be kind, do to others what you'd like done to you. It's just so easy and it's things that we kind of overlook as we're going into third and fourth year. And as I continue to reflect, I've realized that when you're starting in clerkship or in any new workplace, really, you really have to be the kindest and the most hardworking person in order to continue to advance or get to that next level, whatever that might be. 
So those are my three laws. What's the moral of the story? Well, being in the hospital can be a pretty daunting task, especially when you're just starting off third year. But I hope by following these three laws, it kind of takes off the edge a little bit. And if you found this video helpful, please consider subscribing. It would mean a lot to me, and it kind of helps out with the algorithm. Until next time, tons of peace, love, and gains for you all.